Hey guys, it's Little Kelly here and today we are going to be taking a look at this Angry Birds Go set and it's Jenga. So that's pretty cool. By the front of the box it looks like we're going to be making a tower. Well, it's actually called Tower Knockdown, so we'll be making a tower and then knocking it down. That seems pretty simple enough. And then on the back it has more images of a ramp and stuff like that and then the pieces that come with it. So I haven't done a toy like this yet but I do like breaking stuff and knocking down stuff because I'm quite clumsy and I do it a lot so I may as well do it in a game. So guys let's open up the box, take a look at what we get and set this up. So as you can see guys, there's not too many parts of this set, but that does not mean it's not going to be a lot of fun because I know it is. So we get this little launcher pad, so that clicks in backwards and then that will be shooting the car, so that's pretty cool. Then we also get this ramp that will the car will lead up onto and hit the tower hopefully. And then we also get the blocks to build the tower, and we'll do that in a minute, and we get these two little piggies. One with a bone and skull on his head. And then the other one has kind of like a little bandana with feathers. He looks pretty funny. Look at, check him out. <laughs> I can see you. This one's pretty funny too. But it's not as funny. His mouth isn't as open. But he's still pretty funny. And then check the bird out in this car. He looks like one angry bird. So that's pretty sweet. And he will hopefully fly up the ramp from the launcher and hit the tower and knock all them down. So they say that this game is a one to two player game. So you can play this with one of your friends or you can play on your own and try and knock over the tower. Obviously today I'll be playing on my own and that's okay because then that means I obviously win. <laughs> that's okay. So guys, let's build the tower and let's get knocking it down. So guys, to start building our tower, we have five pieces. We've got two lighter ones and three darker green ones. So we're going to set off by putting this guy with the big angry face. He looks like he's a big fat face. Look how angry he is. And that's going to be at the very bottom. And then the next piece we're going to have is this one here. And he looks equally as angry and he's smaller, but he has a bit of a squishy face. So that one has a hard face, but he has a squishy nose, if you can see that. Look at Ben. And then this one just has a squishy face all together. So then that one will go on top of that one. And then the next one we are going to use is this one. And this guy has a big nose or a beak, whatever way you want to see it. But he looks, again, like an angry bird. They all seem quite tribally themed, I guess, which is pretty cool. And I think he looks pretty awesome. His beak is pretty, look at his frown. <laughs> Well, that might be his actual his belly, but he just looks so funny. So he's going to go on top of that block. So we have three so far, and now we are going to stack the next one, which is this one. So it has two solid birds on our edge, and then we have one with a squishy face as well. So that's pretty cool, and it's actually a lot bigger than the other ones, a lot longer. So that's going to sit on top. And then finally, we have our last block to put on, and he has a squishy face. He can move his eyebrows up and down, and he has a squishy nose, but it looks pretty cool. And then his hair is there as well, but he's the only triangular bird that we got on this, which is pretty awesome. But we're going to place him at the very top, so he's going to go on there. And there we have our tower nearly built. you think that would be it because we have all the pieces, but no, we have to put our little piggies on. So I'm going to put this piggy onto the top with the bandana, show you now, and then we're going to put this one on the edge. So hopefully they come flying off too, but they're made of squishy stuff, so that's fine. 
they won't break anything. So now we just have to set up our launcher and our ramp, aim it at our tower and then just see what chaos ensues. See what knockdown we get and <laughs> we can make up some points and stuff like that and see how many blocks we get and the piggies too. So let's set up the ramp. So guys, there is our ramp leading up to our tower and you can see our little piggies on the top there. So we are going to just set up the launcher just behind back here and we're going to pop the car in and then that just rests there and all it's gonna do is give the car a push so I'm gonna try lead this ramp up so that it's gonna hit the tower perfectly what do you reckon I think the tower is a little bit to the side maybe we should just go with this angle a little bit hmm maybe there okay I think that will work now we just have to line the car up again sit it onto the launcher so you can see there's little grooves and that's just going to sit in nicely before it gets pushed. Okay guys, so I'm going to have you guys watching the car this time to see how fast it goes from the launcher. So on three, two, one. Oh, that was a bit of a fail. Let's try that again. Maybe I didn't press it quick enough. So three, two, one. Whoa, you didn't get to see that knockdown, but I'll do another one. Did you see how fast that car left? Look at the carnage on that end of the table. So this time we're gonna show the car knocking down the tower. That would be pretty cool. And then the next part, it will be how it goes off the ramp. But this toy is so awesome. I had a lot of fun doing that. Well now let's reset that tower and then we'll give it another go. Okay guys, I have rebuilt our tower and this time you're going to get to see how the car crashes into it. I'm really excited. So you're actually going to see it come off the end of the ramp as well, which is pretty cool. So on three, two, one. Ah, no, I'm nervous. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, sorry. Three, two, one, go. Wow, it only hit the top blocks. The ramp is obviously aimed a little bit too high, but that's still pretty cool. Let's see that again. Let's see the car hit the tower from this angle. Three, two, one. Wow, that was a good crash. Look, the car even ended up upside down. So guys, I just wanted to show you how fast this car actually leaves the launch, the launcher. So I'm gonna go three, two, one. Do you see how quick that went? It is so fast, it is awesome. So let's try hitting the tower from the side and see if that makes any more difference. So three, two, one. Whoa, that was cool. So guys, that is our Angry Birds Jenga set tower knockdown and that was a lot of fun. I loved knocking down the tower using the ramp, the speed from the launcher. It was a super fun toy and I haven't done one like that before and it was pretty, pretty cool. So uh, let me know in the comment section below if you think I should do some more Angry Bird toys like this. And don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you again soon.